This is Fat Life Unfiltered, and <laughs> I started bouncing. I was moving my leg, so I'm like nervous twitch. So, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and jump into things. Updates. My eye surgery is scheduled for May 11th, so if you didn't watch that video, caught you up. <laughs> um, I have keratoconus. I'm going blind on my left eye. I have to have a corneal transplant um, that will be taken care of on May 11th. Okay, as far as dieting, I'm about to skip back. I don't remember exact time frames you know like dates other than like a couple weeks ago so from my last video last video I did I was starting to already gain weight I think I had gone from like 303 to 305 to 309 and within the past couple of weeks I jumped up to 313 it's only been this past week that I have kind of slid back down <laughs> and I am now at 309 so I've lost four pounds um, this past week but I'm not calorie counting. So did I binge during that time? No, I didn't actually binge eat, like meaning like, oh, I ate 20 bags of potato chips in one day and ate, you know, a dozen eggs. And that's binge eating. When I binge eat, that's what it sounds like. This was more or less just me not focusing on any of my meal plan. So it was more or less just a derailment. Um, but when I had gone to a doctor's appointment, for UTI and also too for a little weird rash that I keep getting on my finger. Um, I was told I was at 313 pounds. <laughs> so that was kind of like a, oh, you know, so within a couple of weeks, yeah, your girl jumped up about 10 pounds. This whole past week though, I have been doing calorie counting and I have gone down four, which I'm happy about that. I'm at 309, but that still leaves me like, I think a five to seven pound difference than where I was even a few weeks prior to that before I even started gaining some of the weight back. So that's what's kind of been going on. Or say, you know, I'm not going to get on here and be like, oh gee, we you know, don't know what happened. I was trying. No, I wasn't. <laughs> um, but I wanted to let you guys know what's been going on. Um, the reason why I'm jumping off my meal plan for right now though is the fact that I kind of feel like I'm over thinking things and I've been doing that for the past few months um, I had made a comment on a Facebook group that I'm in and I just kind of was thinking back to you know like when I started I would start off doing my John Cena meal plan and then after that I was gonna go gluten free and then after that I changed it to I think just going low carb and then after that I was gonna change it back to my John Cena and then after that I thought about going vegetarian for a minute and then after that I thought about going back on my John Cena <laughs> and just you know on and on and on and I was like why do I keep doing this why do I I don't know what's lacking I don't know what's missing but I keep feeling like I when something's not working for the one or two weeks that I'm on that I need to jump start and do something drastic and go to another meal plan just something you know out of the box all of a sudden to just get me back on track and none of it has been working because one if you don't stick to any meal plan for at least a few you know three to you know at least a good three months you're not really gonna get the benefits or see results that you could from sticking to any of these meal plans so I'm like I just need to dumb it down for myself I've been so stressed about finances and my eye surgery coming up and what were we what are we gonna do all that stuff going on and then my headaches were just off the hook my mood wasn't right I could tell I was just you know like I'm always on a constant you know that's what I feel like that's my life um, and I just was tired of thinking about anything and so the calorie counting I was like you know what I'm gonna go back to basics I'm just gonna go back to portion control and I'm just gonna go back to calorie counting I don't want to have to think about oh I can't eat this I can only eat these and if I can't find these I just needed to stop. So this whole past week has felt like, I don't know what, has felt like a weight has been lifted off my shoulders. It just has been nice to go, you know what, I want what you're having or I want that, but I have to just be careful to what the calories are. Um, in a way though, it's kind of just made me feel like a sense of, <sighs> like a breath of, you know, just, 
Now I know not all calories are created equal and you have to still find a balance because it is really easy to go, you know, I want to eat that candy bar, it's within my calories, but then, you know, I'll just have a smaller dinner and then, you know, you find yourself not full after your dinner. Um, I've been pretty smart about, I know what my main meals are. It's the snacks that I kind of let filter in a little bit that I have not been freaking out about. Um, and I've also been adding fruit back into my diet, which on my previous plan, I couldn't have any fruit. But in exciting news, just kind of randomly, um, I'm also going to be changing my hair color. So the red is going. Um, I'm going to go back to dark. Um, I'm thinking about some highlights. We'll post a video on Thursday. Um, I will have videos kind of throughout, you know, the week, I'm sure, but they're just going to be kind of non-scheduled, and when I feel like it, I feel like it. But I'm hoping to do a little update at least once a week up until my um, corneal transplant, but then hopefully after that, get back on a schedule. But right now, it is what it is. So that's what's been going on with me thus far and what my new approach kind of is going to be gonna go ahead and end this that's my update that's everything that's been kind of going on where I'm at so hope you guys are having a good day hope you had a good week I hope you guys have had a good couple of weeks and if you're not staying on track I hope you have been able to just kind of not beat yourself up and just readjust restart do what you gotta do yeah gotta get the mind frame back so until next time and we're in a few days I'll see you thanks bye